I'm Allison Rosen. This is uh, Show Your Stash Day. So this video is going to be what's in my stash of diamond paintings, as well as how I keep track of my stash of diamond paintings, because it's getting to be plentiful. I haven't actually counted, uh, nor do I plan to, but there you go. So let's just uh, start. What I uh, discovered to do, decided to do, was my index card system that you see here. Some of this I may have said in other videos, but this is just one comprehensive video about organizing and sharing my stash. So, I did see another video, maybe it was on Facebook, I really don't remember, of someone who kind of did this same thing. I tweaked it a little bit, but the index card to keep track of everything, you know, was something I saw somewhere and I was like, oh, index cards, of course. So the way I did it was I took my inventory sheets that came with them and cut out the picture that is usually up in the corner of the paper right up here. And then I took the numbers, the key of the sheet, and I cut it up and I glued it right on the back here. And on the front, I also just wrote down like quickly um, the number of bags and the code that you needed. Um, at one point I stopped doing that, but I kind of like the way it looks with it on there. Anyways, it's just aesthetic, really. And so I, each one has the name of the painting that I assigned it because they don't really come with names, the size, the store I got it at, and how many colors it is. The uh, absent thing here is the price because uh, yeah, I don't, uh, uh, yeah, mm -hmm, don't care. I mean, I care, I just don't care to remember all the time. <laughs> so let's just go through it. Okay, so that's, uh, and then what do I do? I just, when I wanna start a new painting, I just go through these real quick, like a pair, pack of playing cards, and I pick one. And then I go and find the canvas, and my canvases are all stored flat on their back. On, um, well, when I was downstairs, they were on a table, and now that I'm upstairs, they're underneath a coffee table where no one can walk. So let's get going. Okay, so this is my color swirl. I bought this one. I'm gonna go through them a little bit, you know why? Uh, because of the colors, obviously. Uh, love the bright colors in it, and I just thought it would be really fun to do and really bright. These I got because I just love little shops. And there's a series of them in here. Um, the shop actually had eight different ones. Yiwu Diamond, DIY Diamond Shop. I have a lot from them. Um, I like their kits. Their diamonds are pretty good. Um, I've done now two or three. Three, I think, of their paintings. Was the nails from them? I don't know. Good question. Is the nail one in here or did I? Yeah, it is. Yep. The one I just did, this one, uh, is also from their store. So yeah, they're they're coming together very nicely. So I do recommend the store. Absolutely. Okay. This one is a 40 by 30. I called it umbrella shop because there's a little umbrella on top of the shop. It's a 40 color. And um, yeah, I just love these. And this one, actually, I had asked the store because I usually think, oh my gosh, I have to go really big to get the detail on this type of thing. So I asked the store, I messaged them and I said, hey, can you show me a mock-up of what a 40 by 30 would look like? And they did, and it looked perfectly fine. So I was like, sure, I'll take it. Like I was saying, they had about eight, but the, for some reason, I've never had this before and I meant to message them, but then I didn't. Um, they only let me buy five and said, this article is limited to five, but it was five different SKUs. It was very weird. I couldn't buy all eight of the little shop series. Anyways, um, now this one has a number one on it because I started labeling the canvases and then I stopped doing that because mm, no, it doesn't matter. Just look at the picture on the canvas. So this one I called Japanese shop with red lanterns, 40 by 30, 40 colors, same store, but oh, I just love that. And if you can't read it in the final picture, it's okay because I can't read it anyway. This one is called Blossom, same, same deal, 
Same store, same size, only 39 colors. This one I called Fruit and Veggie Shop because I am so original. This one I called Creperie La Bretonne. Breton? Breton? Not sure. Um, it's a crepe restaurant. Isn't that sweet? And like they're kind of watercolorish, sketchy looking in the originals, so they will work out quite nicely, I think, as diamond paintings. This one uh, is a four pack. So this one came with all four. And what I like a lot about these ones, um, this is also from the Yibu DIY Diamond Store. I'm a fan. Um, what I like is that the keys across all four, same key. So oops, that got a little smooshed up, but that's okay. Um, it's the same key. So like all four of the paintings will take 32 bags of 827, for example. So when I started, when I start to pull the, when, for anyone that I do, I would just pull all the colors because I think they all have the colors in them. Um, yeah, I really like these. I like them as a four pack. And I did 30 by 30. This one, okay, now this starts uh, Color Whispers. There might be others thrown in. I don't think they're in any order. Um, and I call this one San Leo 1851. I love, I love like pictorial homes and shops and um, stands and kiosks and yurts. I don't know. I like them all. Uh, this is a 60 by 50 and it's 42 colors. And again, my key is on the back. So if what do I do now that it's glued to the back, you may ask? Well, when it's time to do the painting, I will take this downstairs to my printer. Oh wait, maybe I'll bring the printer up here. We'll see what happens. And make copies of this side. And now they're like nice, like it's not a full sheet of paper, it's just a little thing that I have to manage. And um, not that you can't manage a piece of paper, but eh, what you gonna do? And then I'll make copies of this and then use that for my setup for the kits when I get to them. Here we have oh, a beautiful succulent. This is also 40 by 50 and it's from the Yiwu, a diamond store with 40 colors. This one is huge. I got a 90 by 63, 90 by 60. This is from Home Fun. Um, and it's uh, shaking. It's a bicycle bakery. Yeah, see for all that detail, I really had to go big. And so I did. Yay. Another big one, 60 by 90. And this is candy jars, also by Home Fun. So with all these huge paintings, maybe you can see why I'm trying to figure out a way to cut them down and put them back together if you saw my other video on the subject. You have to have a little Hello Kitty, a little 25 by 25. It's actually very sweet looking canvas. It's from Color Whisper. This one I was missing a 761 and I don't have any extras so I have to buy some. When I get there and this one is to um they sent me extras of 666 okay and there's the key on the back clear key shabby mason jars I love pastels and there's not a lot of pastel paintings out there at all so I got this one mostly because I love the colors and it's it's okay you know probably would look nice in maybe a bathroom or something and it's a 60 by 75 and I got it from the Eiffel Angel store. Here we have a colorful world map. I really wanted to do a map. Um, I like this one out of the ones that I saw. And it's a 90 by 60 and it's from the Real Shining official store and it's a 44 color. Now we have a bike in Paris. 
But now that I look at it, that does not look like the Eiffel Tower. Online, it kind of did. But now, not so much. I'll still call it Bike in Paris, though. Why not? Maybe it's Vienna with the, with the um, canal. All right, Bike in Vienna it is. And that's from the Yogo Top official store, and it's a 40 by 60 with 44 colors. This I call City by the Sea. It's from Huacan. And I accidentally ordered a round. Bad copy because Huacan doesn't give you inventory sheets. So I had to make this copy myself. Not very pleased by it. And like, look how crappy my copy came out. Like, yeah. And I don't like at all when they split the symbol from the color because I look for both of those things. I'm not a fan of that. Like, I need to find the W on the yellow gold background um, for my head to like it. And my head does not like it split up like this. At least, maybe I don't. I don't think it does because I haven't done it yet. But this is a round. It's a 60 by 45, a 44 color. And um, Sarah said she wants to do it. So, yay. Happy Hanukkah. Not spelled any way I would have recognized, but no matter, you can read it. And it's a 45 by 60 from Who Can. No way I'm gonna have that time in for this done in time for this year's Hanukkah. So early this year, my God. Um, not all stars belong in the sea. I mean, in the sky. Oops. And I don't know why I got this one. I don't know. I don't really like it. But there it is. Starfish 60 by 45. Ooh, this one is my big honker from Ever Moment. This is the 110 by 150. And it's gorgeous. Oh, I love it so much. Um, yeah, and it's a 58 color. Yeah. Uh, then we have a grocery store, also from Home Fun. This is a 90 by 70. It's 46 colors. And here you can see that I did put them, I glued them to the back. But I also already have them um, printed and cut. Like I already copied it. Um, so I have two of each. And then um, in another video, I'm going to show you how I go ahead and make the stickers out of this because it's a requested video. So, of course, I will show you how I make my stickers. Okay. Uh, then we have Color Whisper, Carnival Boardwalk. See, this is what I love. Busy, busy, busy. Lots of color. This is an 85 by 60 and it's from Color Whisper. 45 colors. See, that's why I have to go so big in my paintings. This is a 90 by 60. Probably didn't have to go that big for this one, but I did. Uh, also from Home Fun, 43 colors. This is the Hardware Star. Um, I love that she's actually buying the th spools of thread over here. And it's a 60 by 45. It's from Yogo Top and it's 44 colors. And I hope I went big enough with this one. We'll see. Uh, from Real Shining Toy Store, 70 by 55, 42 colors. Can you tell I like these stores, guys? I wasn't kidding. Wait, I'm so thirsty. Hang on one second. I'm a soda commercial. Made in the USA. I was shopping at the general store. It's a 90 by 60 and it's from Home Fun. 43 colors to get you far. Okay, I promise no more singing. 
I lied. No, I'm kidding. Reading corner. I mean, you can't go small with these. They're so detailed, and it's a 90 by 60. Home fun. Kids in a pond, for lack of a better description here. Love these. 60 by, they remind me of C. Dick, C. Jane, C. Dick and Jane run, C. Dick and Jane kiss. Ooh, 60 by 45 yoga top, 44 colors. This is another fruit and veggie store. 75 by 55, real shining. This one is Capelli, Capellini, Capelletta. It's a hat shop. Hats, hats and dresses. It's from Color Whisper, and these ones I actually put on the front. Uh, it's a 65 by 50. Another big one. Yeah, that's why I want to cut them down. Oh, let me take these off. Okay. This is Cafe del Aguirre. Agare? I'm not sure. Uh, yep. 60 by 50 color whisper. Uh, this is pink buildings with a boat. 65 by 45. And there's your pink and yellow buildings with a boat. Must be Vienna. This one I did not notice the boat as I was purchasing it. So when I came, I was like, what is that thing on the bottom? It's a boat. This is a lovely fall evening. I know it's one of those, uh, what's his name? I forget his name, but the guy who paints these. I like these, 50 by 40. This is from the AZQSD store. So it turns out that the AZQSD store is actually a who can store. And I bought a whole bunch of theirs. I'm not, I'm not sure where the rest are. But I bought a whole bunch of theirs and none of the drills fit. Those were the ones that kept popping and popping. So finally she said, okay, send me the keys of the paintings and I'll just resend all the drills. Well, it took me a long time to go and like find them in the basement, like scurry them up from wherever they were hidden for the storm. And uh, so it took me like three weeks to get back to her with that. Probably my fault if she doesn't follow through with it, but I hope she does. Uh, so this is lovely fall evening, and it's a 50, 50 by 40. This is a colorful, colorful pond. Um, again, crappy picture because it's right off the canvas, but it could be sweet. I don't know. Uh, this is Articoli per la Natica. I think it's, um, well, it's like nautical equipment is what it means. Articles for nautical, you know, stuff, but... What language? Is that Italian? Articoli? I'm not sure. If you know, let me know. Uh, it's a 65 by 50 and it's from Color Whisper. Ooh, I like this one. Kind of like a watercolorish octopus. It's a 60 by 45 and I got that from A Real Shining. Elephant Blowing Rainbows from Real Shining, 30 by 40. Got this one mostly for my little girl. A four piece of Water Love, much like the four piece of the beach, this one all shares the same key. Came with one sheet for all four of them. And um, she really loved this one. She being Saya. Saya love. Um, so yeah, got these. That's why I had 4 billion 3865s. And these are 30 by 30, a four piece. From the Yiwoo. Yiwoo, Yiwoo. Ah, court and order. Again, crappy picture from a who can. And blue shell 60 by 45. This one is so I got for Sarah. I mean, it's pretty, but it's so not my thing. Anyways, it's an uh, huh, it's a undersea picture with the um, castle and all kinds of stuff on top of it. So, 
yeah she does love this okay fine here you go 65 by 50 and it's the only one i ever got from the petrol diamond company beautiful packaging drills everything was wonderful from them these ones are colorful diamond uh colorful dandelions this is the third of the dandelion series that i have i had a watercolor looking one and i had the one with like the sunset behind it like the layers of sunset really pretty i'll show you those one day they're finished uh 40 by 30 real shining store okay then i got a series of cacti little ones these are 20 by 25s and they're from the u this is cactus in a blue bowl then we've got a blue pot cactus again 20 by 25 boxed cactus 20 by 25 there are 40 colors in this doesn't that seem like a lot of colors in a 20 by 25 pretty cool huh um this is happy cactus this is a fall stroll from the azqsd store copied off a of canvas as you can see this is the one i just finished and it looks so good, I can't wait to show you. Uh, those are my notes for my post review. Don't read those. 50 by 40. And then this is the four piece beach walk, boardwalk. Beach with boardwalk. Beach with boardwalk. 30 by 30 by four, 44 colors, and they all share the same key. And that's the collection. Oh, wait, no. I also have a five panel one, which I couldn't find a picture of like them all together. This is left to right panel four. That's five, one, two, and three. So it would be like this when it's all together, but like these two are smaller than bigger than biggest in the middle, like staggered heights. Um, yeah, there you go. You see, I guess this is kind of where my idea was coming from about cutting them up and putting them back together because isn't this just a picture cut up, right? So maybe I can figure it out. We will see. If you don't know what I'm talking about, there's a whole other video on that. Any case, yeah, thanks for um, coming along and playing stash organizing and looking, uh, stash sharing with me. Um, if there's any of these that you really, really want to find, let me give me a comment and I will reply to you with the link. I'm not going to just link all of them because too much time. Honest is honest. Uh, so yeah, there you go. Thank you so much for sticking around. And until next time, tell me how many you have in your stash. Inquiring minds want to know. Leave me a comment, let me know. Oh, hey, guess what? Don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Yay, big thumbs up. Subscribe, share, all that good stuff. I'll see you later.